Today, so you can see my client, Miss Lillian, here on my iPhone, who I interviewed the other day. Let's see if I can do this. Here you go. Yes, you. No, you look beautiful. Uh, so what do you think about today, the, the kids today, people today, just the way the world... Irresponsible. Good one. Irresponsible. I tell you, I lived in the best generation. Yeah. There you go. I lived in the best generation. Maybe you caught that. And she said, irresponsible. Well, as it goes on, and I interviewed her more, the first part was, the kids are irresponsible today. Then she goes on to say, but like my great-great-grandchildren, she said that the parents spoil them. They don't have anything to work toward. I'm guilty of that. The last part of the interview is really where she, I asked her, well, why do you think you are, uh, you seem to be so vibrant, uh, so fulfilled, and so happy, and basically very healthy at your age? By the way, she's 100 years old, Miss Lillian. You go, Miss Lillian. 100. She said, well, all of my life, even though I had to manage my family and you know do what I have to do like everybody does, I was always involved in three or four project, projects. I go, what do you mean projects? She goes, yeah, you know, volunteering, helping, doing things. She goes, and it's great because you help people, you serve, and we all know that. No secret, right? She goes, but, you know, even if I had problems, didn't get a chance to think about them much because I couldn't change them anyway. There you go, life tip. And I just would get through them because I always enjoy keeping busy and doing a lot. And even at the age of 100, and she came in my office, she was complaining because she was waiting for her girlfriend, who's 90, to come pick her up because she doesn't feel comfortable driving anymore. So there's your tips for today from my client, Miss Lillian. We are a little irresponsible today. We're not strict enough. I agree with you there. But be involved. Do things. Help others. And it helps you. And that's how genes and all that other stuff are involved. But you could just hear it in her voice. What a great attitude. Now, if you want to see more of that kind of stuff, when you come out and see me perform live, I show snippet, snippets of her. And, of course, my other client, as you know, Mary, who's 106. So we can learn a lot from them. Make it a great day. It's the only one you've got.